Hi, uh, my name is Bailey Hagness, and I am a senior at Washington State University studying art history. So with the reductive linoleum cut, you start with a piece of linoleum and then your idea that you're going to draw onto the piece. At least for me, it's definitely an outlet where I can kind of let everything else in my life go um, and just really get, I don't know, my feelings and emotions kind of out and in a different way than I could with words. I've just grown up really appreciating art and always kind of being in my life, either from taking classes or seeing it daily. I didn't really realize that until I actually got here to WSU and just what I was attracted to in studying my, in my classes. My favorite part of the reductive linoleum cut I'm gonna have to say is the final result, but it's kind of probably the buildup from the entire process. I mean, you start with a piece of linoleum that you have to carve out, and it's a lot more work that goes into it than, than probably one really expects to. So it's just kind of getting from step one to going through the entire process and when you run it through the press, when you remove the piece of paper and you lift lift it up and you're able to see how your print turned out and just the color of the ink against the paper, it's definitely my favorite part. Um, getting to create it is an outlet for me. Um, it's always great. I feel like I'm always in like this natural kind of habitat. I just really enjoy that I can pick it up whenever and just getting to see other students create art here too. It's, it's really awesome. If I didn't have art, if the world didn't have art, I feel like it'd be a, a pretty, pretty boring place.